radio. My question is, uh, there are some informations nga uh, nakuha namin no, sa online that wala raw uh, nangyari na ano, wala raw nangyaring bakbakan at uh, may negotiation daw. At uh, sabi pa niya na hindi totoo na inaristo but sumurender daw. So, can you clarify on this uh, mga lumalabas na ganitong uh, uh, class information? Sino ba yung source mo? Pwede ko bang kunan ng statement yan? Yeah, mga, uh, yung mga ano lang, I, I don't know kung mga supporter sila. Uh, or... Siyempre, as a reporter, you're responsible. Yes, sir. Before uh, you put up any issue, you have checked yes, sir. your meron, resources. Meron ho kami, uh, sir. Sino? Kukuhan ako ng statement. If that uh, allegation is true, we will investigate it. But as I said, the moment na nakita yung tropa natin, uh, we were part upon. And, uh, but they surrender later on. Oh, eh, talaga okay. naman yung iba, nakakita lang ng picture eh. Sabihin eh, surrender na eh. Yeah, tama, tama. So, if there is a truth to what he is alleging, come forward and stand by your word. I will investigate. Sign for it. That's the problem with fake news. Okay. So, so wag, okay. wag tayong basta-basta naniniwala na may sinabing ganon. Wala naman sa area, nakakita ng isa-dalawang picture. Eh, yeah. nakonclude niya na. Okay. Na hindi lumaban? Was he there? Okay. If that person were there, eh, he is a reliable. Oh. Sabi Ito na mismo eh. Sila natanungin mo dyan eh. Sila mismo eh. eh. Bakit ka naman lumaban? Eh talagang lalaban ako. So yan ang sinasabi natin. Let us be responsible of entertaining fake news. That is a fake news. Sir, lumaban eh. Nakita mo ba yung par power na yan? Pagka ba humawak ka niyan, ibig sabihin niyan, hindi ka lalaban? This is the mere possession of these firearms. Is your arm to the teeth and wala nang makakapagsabi na hindi lalaban ito. Di sana toothpick ang hawak nila, hindi lumaban. So, I suggest people to be responsible. May nakita lang kayong picture, isa dalawang picture dyan eh, kung ano na ang pinagsasabi nyo. Nakita nyo itong firearms na to? Ala ka naman nilaglag ng pulis to. O, pag ganitong karaming firearms, wala ka ba intensyon lumaban? So that's my answer to that. And he if he is true to this word, take a number of this media. I would like to take the statement of that person alleging uh, that uh, ganyan. I will investigate that. I do not tolerate Indeed. execution style operation. So I will investigate. Take the number and uh, we will get the statement. All right, sir. Uh, Go ahead. Second question, sir, is about sa uh, etong nag-complain. Do we have... Uh, Ah, uh, complainant siya in. Uh, Pakilapit lang yung bibig mo sa mic. Yung ano, uh, yung complainant. Speak sir. properly. Yung complainant po. Okay. Yung complainant. Com yes. Do What about have, the complainant? Do we have complainant here in uh, Ang complainant nga Pilipino uh, people of the Philippines kasi illegal possession of firearms and ammunition and explosive. So, diyan no bail na sila just explosive. So, he will be investigated to that. If you're referring to the complainant of the Ponzi scheme, as I said earlier, we are creating a special intelligence task group. We will assist them so that kung ano yung kaso nilang i-file para makuha nila yung kwarta na nakamkam nitong Apolinario et al. Uh, we will assist them. Kasi for now, yung criminal case yung amin, implementation of the warrant of arrest for syndicated stapa and illegal possession of firearms and uh, explosive. No bail na yon, yung explosive. Plus, direct assault kasi lumaban sila sa police. Plus, illegal uh, association. Oh, dahil, uh, uh, this is a private army. Private armed group na to. So, he will be answerable to that in as much as Karaga 13 is concerned. As to the complaint, the Ponzi scheme, we will assist in the investigation as have ordered by our chief of the Philippine National Police. We will assist the complainant. Kay naluoy man me, kay mga daghang mga dreams ang nawala dahil dito sa mga kalokohan nito na ginagamit ang ginoo para makapangloko ng tao. Ministry. Dapat nag spread ng love yan, eh. hindi nag spread ng panluloko. Eh. Sabi ko nga sa kanya, hindi ka na lang istapador ngayon. Eh. eh, ano ka pa eh? Na, papatay ka pa ng tao? Ano sa man? Next question. Final question, sir. Uh, kailan daw yung Uh, ibang mga scheme investment scheme kailan daw ang operation para sa kanila o ongoing na ba kayo teka teka ito yung press conference natin ano ba yung tinatanong mong ibang iba ito yung press conference natin uh, kapa group can you clarify your question sino yes, pang sir. group yung sinasabi mo yung uh, 
Meron kasi may forex at iba pang mga mga investment team. Ah, hindi yun yung, yung press briefing na to. Yung press briefing na to, isa ka pa international. Anyway, anybody who violates the law, rest assured that the Karaga police will go after them. Even if they possess tank, anti-tank, we have their uh, rapid, rocket propelled grenade. Buti hindi na iputok sa mga bata ako. Alam nyo ba yung rocket propelled grenade? Anti-tank yan.